have decided, because I can't manage my love life on my own, to hire a virtual assistant from India to manage it for me. Ah! I'm here at the Central Park Boathouse about to meet my date, but I'm gonna call and get some last minute pointers from my love guru, Suresh. Okay, here's Suresh calling. Hello. Hi, Suresh. Hi, Suresh, how are you? Tell me again why you thought Jeff would be so great. Jeff, he, he was almost unique from all the other persons and also uh, he just loves what he does. He's very passionate. I selected you to wear a skirt. For you, black would be wonderful. Wow. To use some glances, head movements, uh, fidgets, show some caring for him, even when you speak with him. I'm a little bit nervous before my date. What should I do? Do you have any tips? Just be confident. Do not be serious and have this as, as casual as possible. So what do you do for work? <clears throat> I hang out. Men are not exactly looking for like a catwalk model. How did you feel when you first laid eyes on me? I was uh, extremely pleased. Men do like a great sense of humor. Do you have any raisins? Uh, no, I don't. How about a second date with me? <laughs> Something like open-ended questions. Why? Why what? What if it's going well? Do you think I should kiss him? If you really like him... You're a winner! <laughs> <laughs> if you think that he's a, a great match for you, I, I would say that you have to kiss him. Yeah. My first date with Jeff was really fun. He's totally nice. I think Suresh did an awesome job picking him out. I would definitely uh, see her again. You can get advice on matters of the heart from someone thousands and thousands of miles away who's never met you before, and they can actually give you better advice than you give yourself. I'm Carrie Syme for NYPost.com. <laughs>